Hi, I'm Daryl Hay. I'm one of the regular co-hosts of Clergy and Cars Getting Coffee. I'm also the Rector of St. Andrews in Bryan, as well as the Dean of the Central Convocation of the Diocese of Texas. And I have here some uh, clergy representing our convocation. Uh, they will introduce themselves. I'm Lacey Largent, and I'm the priest at St. Francis in College Station and the spiritual director of Camp Allen. Hi, I'm Lisa Nielsen, and I am the campus missioner at Texas A&M and Blinn College. Howdy, I'm Matt Stone. I'm the curate at St. Andrews, uh, which means Father Daryl is my boss, and I'm also a part of Clergy and Cars Getting Coffee. So this is a, a special edition of, 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 of Clergy and Cars, and we're going to share with you a little bit about this convocation. Uh, first off, I would say the great opportunity we have uh, in the Central Convocation is uh, building community and making disciples. Uh, in Bryan College Station, Texas A&M, all the way to Madisonville, uh, down to Columbus. And we're just going to highlight uh, a few things about this about this great this great this great area. And one of our great opportunities in this convocation is campus ministry. I serve the the community at Texas A and M, and I know there are folks who are very interested in expanding campus ministry at Prairie View A and M. One of the things you'll notice about us is we get along really well, which makes building new ministries possible. At St. Andrews, we're working with the folks at Canterbury to uh, build a student ministry at Blinn College, one of our community colleges here in Bryan that's, that's growing rapidly and needs an Episcopal presence. One of the other exciting things here in Bryan College Station is that we have an area deacon that helps out at all three churches and helps us keep a view toward outreach and the community that we serve. Another exciting thing about this whole convocation is that in the middle of it is Camp Allen, which is the totally most awesome place you can ever go. And it offers so much to our diocese. And so you'll get to be spending a lot of time at Camp Allen for sure in the beautiful 1100 acres that we have. We're all grateful to be so close uh, to such a, a great place. Uh, the, one of the last things we want to highlight, but a, a very important one, is rural ministries. Most of our congregations in this convocation are rural congregations, uh, and you know, so how, one of the things, challenges, and one of the opportunities is how we can, how can we build community uh, within those congregations, but also within those communities in which those congregations are located. Uh, we have some great clergy serving out in, the, in those congregations. So how do we support them and help them build ministry to build community and make disciples?